What's up, everybody? I'm the Burning Sky Cloud, and welcome to a game called Autumn. Now, this is supposed to be a very relaxing game filled with puzzles of fun and soothing music to relax to. <laughs> Autumn is the second spring when every leaf is a flower. if it's a flower in autumn. I never really thought about that. That is actually really cool. Albert Camus. And you, you know, I, I remember my autumn years as a kid. I would love just crunching through the leaves in the backyard, looking at all the beautiful colors of the leaves. New name. Oh, unnamed spirit. I am going to be. Hang on, can I delete? Yeah, I can delete that. I am going to be Skoy. <laughs> okay, what is all of this? Canara is extra prana from spring flowers. 20% less prana cost when planted trees. Okay, so I guess, depending on what I grab, um... Uh, I guess from what I get, uh, either, per, either everything either goes up or down. Like uh, I would need extra prana, whatever that that is, from plucking spring flowers. But it's twenty percent less cost when plant trees. Yaksa. I need. You know, half. Uh, I need 50% less to uh, prana to expand my territory. Items cost 20% less. Wisdom cost is 30% higher. Well, I don't know what that means. Wisdom cost is 40% lower. 20% prana cost increased to plant trees and place items. Sit to high. Which one should I choose? All right, I'm gonna go with Yaksa. I'm gonna see what this is all about. Alright. That's a chest. Alright, so, so what am I doing exactly? Information. Prana orbs lose their energy as time passes. The quicker I observe them, the observer use them, the better. Okay. M Mendoa tree? What is this? What is that? Oh! Oh, it's raining. What am I doing? Oh, this is, okay, so it's uh, a puzzle game. Alright, gotta take that off, gotta take that off. Yeah, da da. I have no idea what I'm doing at the moment. That looks like a hockey puck. Little birds are chipping. Am I even doing it right? I don't know. Oh! Oh! Okay, that explains a lot. Alright, I have an idea. Do that, do that. Do that. Do that. Put you here. Put you... No. 
yeah, put you there. Because I need to put the less bigger rock on top of that one. Then it's all a game about organization. You have been gifted with new inspiration. Oh, cool. Oh, scroll, scroll, give me the scroll. Number 15, Disciplehood. When the great Sufi mystic Hans Hassan was dying, somebody asked Hassan, Who was your master? He said, I had, a th I had thousands of masters. If I just relate their names, it would take months, years, and it is too late. But three masters I will certainly tell you about. Uh, one was a thief. Once I. Oh, one. One was a thief. Once I got lost in the desert, and when I reached the village, it was very late. Everything was closed. But at last, I found one man who was trying to make a hole in the wall of a house. I asked him where I could stay, and he said, At this time of night, it would be difficult, but you can stay with me if you can stay with us. And the man was so beautiful. I, and, uh, and the man was so beautiful. I stayed for one month, and each night he would say to me, Now I am going to work. You rest, you pray. When he came back, I would ask, Could you get anything? He would say, Not yet, but tomorrow I will try again. Can you be lit? He was never in a state of hopelessness. He was always happy. When I was meditating and meditating for years on end and nothing was happening, many times the moment came when I was so desperate, so hopeless, that I thought to stop all this nonsense. And suddenly, I would remember that the thief who would say every night, Kind willing, tomorrow it is going to happen. And my second master was a dog. I was going to the river, thirsty. And a dog came. He was also, he was also thirsty. He looked into the river. He saw another dog there, his own image, and became afraid. He would bark and run away, not barred. But his thirst was so much that he would come back. Finally, despite his fear, he just jumped into the water, and the image disappeared. And I knew that a message had come from me, to me from God. One has to jump in despite of all fears. And the third master was a small child. I entered a town, and a child was carrying a lit candle. He was going to the mosque to put the candle there. Just joking, I asked the boy, Have you lit the candle yourself? He said, Yes, sir. Ha <laughs> ha, wait, I had the Cisco on. Okay. <laughs> As I... And I asked, there was a moment when the candle was unlit. Then there was a moment when the candle was lit. Can you show me the source from which the light came? And the boy laughed, blew out the candle, and said, Now you have seen the light growing. Where has it gone? Will you tell me? I don't know what voices I'm giving these people. My ego was shattered. My whole knowledge was shattered. And that moment I felt my own stupidity. Since then, I dropped all my knowledge ability. It is true that I had no master. That does not mean that I was not a disciple. I accepted the whole existence as my master. My disciplehood was a greater involvement than yours. I trusted the clouds, the trees. I trusted existence as such. I had no master because I had, because I had millions of masters. I learned from every possible source. To be a disciple is a must on the path. What does it mean to be a disciple? It means to be able to learn, to be available to learn, to be vulnerable to existence. With a master, you start learning to learn. The master is the swimming pool, where you can learn how to swim. Once you have learned, all the oceans are yours. The Secret of Secrets, Volume 1. That was a long read, but I never thought about it like that before. Oh. Wow, cool. But yeah, um, oh, I'm trying to see. How do I get out? What is this color wheel? But yeah, uh, I never really thought about it like that before. Oh no. Oh no. The tree is. Oh, okay, yeah, that's over and done with. So I just gotta find out where. Oh. Oh. What is this color wheel, wheel in the sky? Eighty-one percent. Is there any other thing that I can do here <laughs> besides just rock games? 
guess not for right now. Zen stones. Alright, so I gotta find, like... How do I collect granite worms? Oh, it's turning into winter. I can't do anything to unlock this area yet. Or is it... Is it winter or is it turning into spring already? It looks like it's winter because the ground's kind of frosted. Wow, look at that. That's so cool. Give me the piranhas. I don't know what that little timer there is for. Is there anything that I can actually... Oh, the items. You eight. Look what you're new. Oh, I guess I can. Page five. All right, I guess I can acquire new because I'm not finding anything else here. The force that guides the stars guides you. I have 243. So, basically, all it really does is just give me all the new quotes and stuff. It doesn't really give me Oh, wait, did I just see something? That's just a sign. Yeah, it might have been just a sign. I don't even know how I'm collecting the piranha. This tree has been at 81% for a good time now. Oh! That tree finally finished. A new tree. Okay. Uh, I did I did plant a new Mandoa tree because I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing at this point in time. My question is how do I expand? Exit game and return to the main menu. Let me try... Let me try this. Oh, okay, so everything is saved. Mandoa tree is back. Oh, wait, what is this? Wait, hang on, I'm trying to... Tree guild puzzle. I see, so do I have to... Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. So I have to match everything up here, huh? No! Step in it. Okay, that, that's matched. Huh. 
That's matched, that's matched, that's matched. Thank you on the minute. How does this all connect? Okay, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, I got no idea. This is very confusing. <laughs> let me let me check out um Sidai. There seems to be only like one puzzle per area. I'm a little confused on this. Yeah, very confused. I don't know what the lines mean. I don't know, but this doesn't really help me in anything. So yeah, I'm probably just gonna end the game here, cause I'm. I don't know how these puzzles work. I'm not going to bother trying to wrap my head around how they work. The only thing that's actually really interesting about this game is the music.
And I still don't understand how th what this color wheel, how this color wheel comes into play. Uh, if anyone can figure out how this works, you know, feel free to let me know. Cause it's it's confusing the heck out of me. So, uh, I guess this is not what it is. This is just one of those not so good gameplays, I guess. I can see why people find it frustrating to play. Because you have no idea what you're doing. Because these two keep switching and I can't get that to stop. So, thank you for watching. If you enjoy, if you at least enjoyed the music, <laughs> uh, like, comment, share, and there will definitely be a better gameplays to come in the future. So, I'll catch you all later.